Another video about the laws of the game in association football. Today we focus about law 14 which is about the penalty kick. A penalty kick out is awarded if a player commits a direct free kick offense inside their penalty area or off the field as a part of a play as outlined in the row 12 and 13. A goal may be scored directly from penalty kick. One procedure the ball must be stationary on the penalty mark and goal post crossbar, and the goal net must not be moving. The player taking the penalty kick must be clearly identified. The defending keeper must remain on the goal line facing the kicker between the goal post without touching the goal post crossbar or goal net until the ball has been kicked. The players, other than the kicker and the goalkeeper, must be at least 9.15 meters from the goal, from the penalty mark, behind the penalty mark, inside the field of play, outside of penalty area. After the player has taken position in accordance to this law, the referee signal the penalty kick to be taken. The player taking the penalty kick must kick the ball forward. Back healing is permitted providing the ball moves forward. When the ball is kicked, the defending keeper must have at least part of the foot touching in line with or behind the goal line. The ball is in play when it is kicked and cleared the move. The kicker must not play the ball again until it has touched another play. Penalty player. Penalty kick is completed when the ball stops moving, goes out of the play or the referee stops play for any offense. Additional time is allowed for a penalty kick to be taken and completed at the end of each half of the match or extra time. When additional time is allowed, the penalty kick is completed when after the kick has been taken, the ball stops moving, goes out of play, is played by another player including the kicker. Other than the defending keeper, or the referee stops play for an offense by the kicker or the kicker's team. If defending team plays, the player, including the keeper, commits an offense and the penalty is missed, saved, the penalty is retaken. Two offenses and sanctions. Once the referee has signaled for a penalty kick to be taken, the kick must be taken. If it is not taken, the referee may take this disciplinary action before signaling again for the kick to be taken. If before the ball is in the play, one of the following occurs, the play taking the penalty kick or a teammate offense. If the ball enters the goal, the kick is retaken. If the ball does not enter the goal, the referee stop play and restart with an indirect free kick. Except the following when the play will be stopped and restart with an indirect free kick, regardless for whether or not the goal is scored. Penalty is kicked. A penalty kick is kicked backwards. Backwards. A teammate of an identified the kicker takes the kick. The referee caution the player with who took the kick. Fainting to kick the ball once. The kicker has completed the run up. Fainting is the runner up is permitted. The referee caution the kicker. The goalkeeper offense. If the ball enters the goal, the goal is awarded. If the ball missed the goal and the rebound from the crossbar or goal post, the kicker is the kick is only retaken if the goalkeeper offense clearly impacts on the kicker. If the ball is prevented from entering the goal by the goalkeeper, the kicker is retaken. If the goalkeeper's offense result into the kick being retaken, the goalkeeper is one of the first offense in the game and cautioned for any subsequent offense in the game. A teammate of goalkeeper offense, if the ball enters 
the goal. The goal is awarded. If the ball does not enter the goal, the kick is taken. A player of both teams offends. The kick is taken unless the player commits a more serious offense or illegal, illegal, illegal fainting. Both the goalkeeper and the taker commits an offense and at the same time. The kicker is cautioned and the player starts with an indirect free kick to the defending team. If and after the penalty kick has been taken, the kicker touches the ball again before it has touched another player. An indirect free kick or direct free kick to the handball offense is awarded. The ball is touched by an outside agent as it is moving forward. The, kicker, the kick is retaken unless the ball is going into the goal and the interference does not prevent the goalkeeper or the defending team, defending player playing the ball, in which case the goal is awarded if the goal enters the goal, even if contact was made with the ball unless the interference was by the attacking team. The ball rebounds into the field of play from goalkeeper across bar or goalpost and it is then touched by outside agent. The referee stops play. Play is restarted with a drop ball and the position where it touches the outside agent. Number three, the summary. Outcome of the penalty kick. Encroachment by attacking player. Penalty is taken in direct Goal, penalty is taken, no goal, indirect free kick, encroachment by defending team, goal, it's a goal. no goal, penalty is taken, encroachment by defending and attacking player, penalty is taken, penalty, if there is a goal, penalty is taken, if there is no goal, penalty is taken, offend by goalkeeper, if a goal enters, it is a goal, no goal, not saved, penalty is not taken, unless kicker is clearly impacted. Saved, the penalty is taken and the warning for the goalkeeper caution for any other offenses. Keeper and the kicker offend at the same time. Indirect free kick and caution by the kicker. Indirect if the, no goal. If there is a goal, if there is no goal, indirect free kick and the caution to the kicker. Ball picked backwards. If there is a goal, indirect free kick is given. No goal, indirect free kick again. Illegal fainting. Indirect free kick and caution to the kicker. Indirect free kick and caution to the kicker. Whatever it is a goal or not a goal. Long kick. Indirect free kick and caution to the long kicker. If it is a goal. If it is no goal, indirect free kick and caution to the long kicker. More explanations about penalty kick. Penalty kick is also known as a penalty or spot kick is a method of restarting play in association football in which a player is allowed to take a single shot and the goal while at the goal while it is defended by the opposing team's goalkeeper it is awarded when an offense punishable by a direct free kick is committed by a player in their own penalty area the shot is taken from penalty mark which is 11 meters from the goal line and center between the touch lines. The ball is placed on the penalty mark regardless on, of where it's, where in the penalty area the four card. The player taking a kick must be identified by the referee. One, only the kicker and the defending team keeper are allowed to be within the penalty area. All other players must be within the field of play outside the penalty area. Behind the penalty mark at a minimum of 9.15 meter from penalty mark, the distance is denoted by a penalty arc. The keeper is allowed to move before the ball is kicked, but must remain on the touch line between the goal post, touching, facing the kicker without touching the goal post, crossbar or goal net. At the moment the kick is taken, the goalkeeper must have at least one part of foot touching or in line with the goal line.
the assistant referee responsible for the goal line where the penalty kick is being taken is positioned at an intersection of the penalty area and the goal line and an assistant referee is looking for the infringement and or whether the goal is gone. The referee board the whistle to indicate that the penalty kick may be taken. The kicker may make faint, deceptive or distracting movement during the run up to the ball but may not do so once the run up is complete, completed. The ball must be stationary before the kick and it must be kicked forward. The ball is in a play once it is kicked and moves. And at the time, at that time, other player may enter the penalty area and the penalty arc. The kicker may not touch the ball a second time until it has been touched by another player of either team or goes outside of play, including into the goal. Infringements. In case infringement of the law of the game during a penalty kick must commonly enter the penalty area regarding the referee must consider both whether the ball entered the goal and whether the teams committed the offense in the both team commit an offense and the, the kick is taken. Comparison. Results of the kick enter the goal. No violence the goal. Variation by the attacking team only the kick. Variation of defending only a goal. Goes direct out of the bound. Goal kick. If there is no variance. Variance by attacking team only. Goal kick. Variance by defending team on, only. Re kick. Bounding into play by goal frame or goalkeeper. Play continues. Var if there is variation, no variation, play continues. Variation of the attacking team only in direct free kick. Variation of defender only retake. Re kick. Save or held by keeper. Play continues. No variation. Variation by attacking team only. Play continues. Variation by defending team re kick. Deflected out of the bond by keeper. No variation. Corner kick. Variation by attacking team in direct free kick. Variation by defending team re kick. The following infringement committed by kicking team result into a direct free kick for the defending team, regardless of the outcome of the kick. A team of a, a teammate of identified the kicker kicks the ball instead. The player who took the kick is cautioned. Kicker faints kick the ball and end up run at the end of runner ups. The kicker is cautioned. Kick does not go forward. Kick touches kicker touches the ball a second time before it touches another player includes rebounds of the goalpost or crossbar. In case a player repeated the infringement the road during the penalty kick, the referee may caution the player by for persisting infringement. All offenses that occur before kick may be dealt with in this manner, regardless of the direction of the offense, if the ball touches the outside agent, an object for an object foreign to the playing field, as it moves forward from the kick, the kick is retaken. Tape penalty. Two main penalty or tape penalty occur when the kicker, instead of shooting for the goal tapes the ball slide, slightly forward to so that a teammate can run in on into it and shoot or pass if properly executed it is legal play since the kicker is not required to shoot for the goal and need only kick to the ball forward this strategy relies heavily on the element of surprises as it first inquired the goalkeeper to believe the kicker will actually shoot, then dive or move to one side in response. It then required the goalkeeper to remain out of position long enough for the kicker's teammate to reach the ball before the defender and the 
and for the teammate to press a shot or no and defend the side of the goal. The first equal step penalty was taken by Jimmy, Mercury and Danny Branch Flower of Northern Ireland against Portugal on 1st May 1957. Another was taken by Rick Coppens and the Andre Pete Peters in the World Cup qualifier match. Belgium vs. Ireland on 5th June 1957. Another attempt was made by Mike and John Newman playing for Prince Mouse Agri in 1964. In 1962, Joan Cruyff passed to his Ajax teammate Jasper Oslin, who then passed back, uh, allowing Cruyff to tap in for a goal. As a player, Thierry Henry and Robert Pierce failed in an attempt at a similar penalty in 2005 during a Premier League match against Manchester City at Highbury. Pierce ran in, into Turkey, attempted to pass to the on rushing Henry, but missed kicked and the ball had removed. As he had slightly touched the ball, he could not touch it again. And the city defender, Sylvie Diste, cleared the ball before Henry could shoot. Messi tapped the penalty, tapped the penalty for Suarez as Suarez tempted to his hat trick in on. 14th February 2016 against league league opponent Celta de Vigo. Penalty saving techniques leading the kicker. Defending against a penalty kick is one of the most difficult tasks a keeper can face. On the short distance between the penalty shot and the goal, there is very little time to react to the shot. Because of this, the keeper will usually start their dive before the ball is actually struck. In effect, the goalkeeper must act on their best prediction about where the shot will be aimed. Some keepers decide which way they will dive beforehand, thus giving themselves a good chance of diving in time. Others try to read the kicker's motion pattern. On the other side, the kicker often fails and prefer a relative slow shot in the attempt to foil the goalkeeper. The potentially most fruitful approach should high and central in the space that the keeper will evacuate also carries the highest risk of shooting above the bar. As the shooter marks makes their approach to the ball, the keeper has only a fraction of the second to read the shooter's motion and decide where the ball will go. If their guess is correct, they may result into missed penalty. Duncan Dan Bucharest keeper save a record for consecutive penalty in 1986. European Cup final against Barcelona. He dived three times to the right and the fourth time to his left to save all penalties taken, securing victory for his team. Use of knowledge of kickers. A goalkeeper may also rely on knowledge of the shooter's past behavior to inform his decision. An example of this would be former Netherlands keeper, keeper Van Berkeen, who was who always had a box with card with all the information about the opponent's penalty specialist. Ecuadorian keeper Marcelo Elizaga saving a penalty from Carlos David in a match between Ecuador and Argentina. He very that he had studied some penalty kick from Tevez and just he was going to shoot to the keeper's left side. Two other examples occurred during 2006 FIFA World Cup. Portugal national team keeper Ricardo in the quarterfinal match against England, where he saved three penalties out of four. 
the quarterfinal match between Argentina and Germany also came down into penalties and German keeper Jens Lehmann was seen looking at a of paper kept in his socks before each Argentina player would come forward for penalty kick. It is presumed that information on each kick has habit were written on his paper. Lehman saved the two of four penalty taken and came across to save a third. This approach may not always be successful. The player may intentionally switch from their favorite spot after witnessing the keeper obtaining knowledge of his kicks. Most time, especially in amateur football, the keeper is often forced to guess game theoretic. Such showed that both the penalty taker and also keeper must randomize their strategy in a precise way to avoid having the opponent take advantage of their predictability. Distraction. The keeper also may try to distract the penalty taker as expecting when is on the penalty taker to succeed. Hence, more pressure on the penalty taker, making them more vulnerable to, to mistakes. For example, in 2008 UEFA Champions League final between Manchester United and Chelsea, United the keeper Edwin van der Sar pointed to his left side when the Nicolas Anelika skipped up to take a shot in the penalty shootout. This was because all Chelsea penalty went to the left. Anelika shots instead went to Van Dasa's light, which was saved. Liverpool keeper Bruce Grabriera used the method to distract the players called Supergetti's leg. League to help his club defeat Roma to win the 1984 European Cup. This tactic was emulated in 2005 UEFA Champions League final, which Liverpool also won by Liverpool keeper Dudek helping his team defeat Milan. An illegal method of saving penalty is for the keeper to make a quick and short jump forward just before the, the penalty taker connects with the ball. This is not only shut down the angle of the shot but also distract the penalty taker. The method was used by Brazilian keeper Claudio Tafares. FIFA was less strict on the rules during the that time, in a more recent time, FIFA has advised or referred to strictly obey the rules of book. Similar, a keeper may also attempt to delay penalty by cleaning his boots, asking the referee to see if the ball is placed properly and delay tactics. This is method to build more pressure on the penalty taker. But the keeper may risk punishment, most likely a yellow card. A keeper can also try to distract the taker by taking the pulling the penalty being taken. After by talking to them, pulling the penalty being taken. The Northern national keeper team crew used the technique during penalty shootout in their quarterfinal match in 2014 if he fought the cup against Costa Rica. As Costa Rican player were preparing to take the penalty, Tim Crow told them that the, he needs he knew where they were going to put the, their penalty in order to get in their head. This resulted into him to save two penalty and then rather than the win the shootout four to three. Scoring techniques, even if the keeper succeeded in blocking the shot, the ball may rebound back to the penalty taker or one of his teammates for another shot, with the goalkeeper often in poor position to make a second save. This makes save penalty kicker more difficult. This is not a concern of penalty shoot out, where only a single shot is permitted. All the penalty kicker kicks are considerably more often successful than not. Missed penalty kick are not uncommon. For instance, 
of 78 penalty kicks taken during 2005-2006 English Premier League season. 57 resulted into a goal. Thus, almost 30 percent of penalties were unsuccessful. Germany professor who has been studying penalties at the German Bundesliga for 16 years found 76 percent of all penalties during those 16 years went in and 99 percent of shot in the higher half of the goal went in although the higher half of the goal is more difficult to target to aim during his career Italian striker Roberto Baggio has twice of has two occurrences where he shot hit the bar bouncing back down the boundary of to the keeper and passed the goal line for a goal. Saving statistics, some keepers have become well known for their ability to save penalty once. Such a goalkeeper is a Bolivian and Flamingo Diego Alves who blasted a 45% save successful success rate other keeper with high rate including claudio bravo kevin trapp samir Andonovic, genuigi buffon tim crow danny super super Sitch, and newell never offenses for which the penalty kick is awarded a penalty kick is awarded when one of the following offenses committed by player within that pen, with that penalty Player own penalty area. While the ball is in play, the ball must be in play at the time of the offense, but it does not need to be within the penalty area at that time. Handball, excluding hand, hand, handballing offense committed by the goalkeeper. Any of the following offenses against the opponent is if committed in a manner of Considering by referring to be carelessness, weakness, weakness, and use excessive forces, charges, jumps at, kick, or attempt to kick, push, strike, or attempt to strike, including the headbutt, tackles, or challenges, strips, or attempt to strip, holding an opponent, impending the opponent with contact, biting or spitting at someone, throwing. An object that the ball or opponent or much official act or marking contact with the ball which held an object. The location of the offense is considered to be the position where the object stuck or would have stuck to the person or the ball and the nearest boundary if this is off the field of play. Any physical offense against teammates, substitute, substituted, or center of prayer, team official or match official. A prayer who, re who requires the referee permission to enter the field, substitute, substituted, center of prayer. All team official enters the field at the over prayer. Without to refer to permission and interfere with pre. A real example of this offense occurred in October 2019, match between Holstein, Crane, and Bohum. Substitute Mike Oberwin ran up behind his own goal, his own team's goal line. Kicked the ball before it has gone out of a play. The referee awarded the penalty to. Bohum after a valid review. A player who requires the first permission to enter the field of playing substitute, substituted the prayer center of prayer or team official on is on the field of play without the first permission while that person team score a goal. The goal is disallowed. The location of offense is considerable to be the location of offender and the time to disallow the goal or squad. At the time when the disallowed goal was scored, a player temporarily of the field substituted, substitute, substituted the player center of prayer or a team official slow or kicks an object into the field of play and the object interfere with the play. An opponent and a match or a match official, the location of the offense is considered to be the place where the off throw 
or kick object interfere with play or struck or would have struck the opponent match official or the ball a penalty kick is also awarded if while the ball is in play a player substitute substituted the player center of player or team official commits any direct free kick offense against a match official or against an an opponent player substitute substituted center of player or team official outside the field of play provided that the crossed boundary to the location of the offense is within the offense team's own penalty area. Thank you for being with us. This is Asha Vista. If you like, you can subscribe, comment, and tell your friend to join us. I'm Jan. See you in the next video. We love you. And God bless you. Stay with us. This is Asha Vista, the home of football, future, present, and the past. See you.